At Hexagon Geosystems, we take our exclusive technology, premium technology, which we try to push beyond the limits and include it into simplified smart devices, make it exclusive technology so it's accessible to everyone. Exclusive technology, for example, our um, single photon lighter, the SPL100, is a new lighter technology which is exclusive for certain industry segments and it's exclusive in the way that here we try to push the technology, pushing what's feasible to, to, to the limits. Inclusive technology, on the other side, is technology that we take from the exclusive technology and put it into smart, simplified devices and though making it accessible to everyone. Yeah, taking for example the BRK360 is a very nice example for moving exclusive technology to inclusive technology. Um, a lot of our exclusive technology is based on waveform digitizing. This is a, a key technology in our premium product. And for the BRK360, we put this technology, miniaturized it, uh, put it on a few microchips and um, embedded it into a very user-friendly um, one, uh, one push-button operated system, the BAK360. So in this way we make it inclusive into the device and then accessible to everyone. <laughs> We see at, at Hexagon Geosystems that uh, certain technologies um, would have a broader footprint or would trigger application which we currently not, not think about it or are not uh, imaginable for us at this point of time. Uh, because to um, the exclusiveness uh, of the devices they're in, fit for purpose solution, um, so when we when we bring it um, to 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 everyone, when we simplify the workflow, when we simplify the the operation, um, we see and the the BAK three hundred and sixty is a very nice example for this. Um, we see that um, applications come to light, uh, trades come to light, which never use three D technology, never use scanning before. Though democratization of technology means for us to, to broaden the accessibility of certain technologies which uh, just have been reserved in the past to a very exclusive uh, field of applications. There are two ways to go in the future. The first of all um, is uh, in the exclusive field uh, of technology, premium technology. There we always want to be the technology leader. We want to, to take our technologies and push us to the limits. And uh, where the, the limits are achieved or we cannot push it further, we would like to come up with other technologies, even bringing it further. For example, the single photon light uh, SPL100 is, is very nice here. Uh, with our linear airborne lighters, we had a certain point density. And for going onto single um, photon lighter technology, we pushed the limit even further. On the other way, the um, technology accessibility for, for everyone that we experience currently in the BRK360 is only the, the start of the journey for us. We have seen um, by the response of the market, by the response of the, of the users, that this is also for, for us a, 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 a way to go, a very important way to go, that uh, not only technology remains exclusive uh, for, for, for a segment, but also by taking it uh, into the BLK360 way, into smart uh, devices, one, uh, one push button operations, um, that uh, we can, we can uh, open the door for, for further application, for further segments, uh, for, for even for people and trades that have never used 3D technology in the beginning. And uh, so it's a two-way strategy and we will certainly follow this at Hexagon Geosystems. Mm -hmm.